There is palpable tension in parts of Enugu and Abia states. After Namde Kano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, was arrested by the Nigerian government as military personnel have flooded major highways. Some residents confirmed this to Sahara reporters, saying the heavy presence of security personnel, mainly policemen and soldiers, have been noticed in the past few days. One of the residents in the Ohafia community of Abia State said, following the development, they were awaiting videos of Namdekano and wanted him to address them. Many people find it difficult to believe the report because there, was, there are no videos to support claims that Namdekano has been arrested. If Namdekano is truly arrested, the youth of the Southeast in our usual practice will defend him, a resident said. Soldiers have been all over Enugu town in Enugu state for the past few days. We were still wondering what could have happened. They are on major roads in Abia too. But one thing is clear. The voice of the people cannot be subdued. May the military Maybe the military will kill everyone in the southeast and start living there, another resident said. Sahara reporters had earlier reported that Namdekano was picked up at a location in Africa, and the Nigerian government only decided to be manipulative about the details. He was not arrested in London or anywhere in the United Kingdom. Diplomats confirmed that Kano was picked up somewhere in Africa. The family of IPOP are very unhappy. Apparently, they have known about the trail or the trailing and arrest for about some time, a top source stated. Sahara reporters had earlier reported that the family of Namde Kano asked the federal government not to manhandle their son who is currently in the custody of the Department of State Services. Speaking in Umahia, the Abia State Capital, Namde Kano's younger brother, Emmanuel Kano, said, the IPOB leader stood on the path of truth and committed no crime to deserve any persecution. According to him, Namde Kano was only asking for the freedom of Biafrans, which is their fundamental human right. Hence, his rights should be respected. He said, The whole world is watching how the Nigerian government will handle Namde Kano. He further noted that his brother had awakened the consciousness of Nigerians about the goings on in the country. My brother stood for the truth, and heaven is on the part of anyone standing for the truth. He committed no crime, and the whole world is watching. Namdekanu's brother added. All right, guys, what are your thoughts concerning this particular issue as it is? It has been reported that there has been an easy camp in the southeast as soldiers flood major towns in the southeast. Well, probably, you know, after the news of his arrest, of Namdekanu's arrest, you know, directives were given to um, military men to actually flood the streets in the southeast. And probably that is the result of what we are seeing, or what we have we are, we've, we just heard, rather, that um, military men, soldiers, flooded the uh, southeast. Well, it remains to be seen, actually, what exactly is going on. You know, the news of Namdekano's arrest might have just triggered this particular action and decision of the government. But it is what it is. However, if there's the, the, the um, Southeast you know, the, now witness the presence of soldiers, police, and all what have you, then to a very large extent, it could be related to the arrest of Namdekano which to a very large extent is something that might just be expected. And the activities of the unknown gunmen had probably gone down over the 
course over some days or weeks now as it is the question is will this reveal or shed more light into the activities of the unknown government does does it mean that nigerian soldiers now have um more uh how do i put it now is it that they now have more confidence are they now more emboldened to carry out their activities in the southeast are we going to be seeing more arrests of ipop members or southeast youth people youths who might be assumed or labeled as ipop members leaders or eastern security network members these are questions that you know we need to ask or that might be asked in the coming days it is what it is now that Nambe Kano has been arrested by the Nigerian government as it is, what happens to members of the indigenous people of Biafra and the Eastern Security Network? What happens to them? Are we going to be seeing more arrests? Are we going to be seeing more um, camps being busted? What will be the situation of things? Who will uh, sponsor or continue to support the uh, activities of the Eastern Security Network members? What would have become of them? These and many more are questions that are begging for answers. But it is what it is. The leaders or Igbo leaders in the Southeast, to a very large extent, will do well to ensure that uh, calm is maintained throughout the southeastern states because at the slightest opportunity or provocation there could be serious protests which might eventually lead to destructions so if care is not taken some of these things might just uh, eventually be uh, the order of the day but we we'll keep our fingers crossed to see how things unfold. What are your thoughts, guys, concerning this particular situation? It is um, sad. At the same time, it is unfortunate that, you know, things are happening. While it is good news to some, it is bad news to some. But to you, what do you think? Well, please drop by at the comment section. Let's know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you are yet to subscribe. Please, kindly hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Endeavor to share these new stories with your friends, family, relations, and loved ones so they can get to know what is happening around the world and be informed. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support. And I'll see you on the other news. Thank you and bye for now.